Vienna. When I say it like that, that's an ick. Also, my hair is an ick as well. My forehead is an ick. I'm sorry. It's another couple's trip with my wifey for lifey. No, you're like the, the affair. Can you not put that in? Oh, no, that was so weird. <laughs> just start again. Can you just start the whole thing again? Can you just Stress. not tell me how to do my job? Just... We're in. No, I'm not going to okay, do it again. again. <laughs> We bought a bottle of, what is this? It's Prosecco. A it's a baby bottle. Because we're going to the ballet tonight. This trip is like a sophisticated yeah. weekend away. We're 22, <laughs> which is not news, but like, it's, a, it's just a, can you just tell us? It's, it's just a winter. I just don't even know why I make videos at this point. There are no flutes. Okay. I know this is criminal. Yeah. Why are you choosing them and not me first? You haven't even poured me a drink. Oh, yeah. I want um, uh, orange juice. Oh, yeah, I've got that. Uh, there's a lot riding on this Instagram tonight. Oh, my lord. That's <laughs> not why we have to be early. We have to be early because I don't want to be late for the ballet. It's kind of a time crunch. <laughs> <laughs> time crunch. <laughs> Careful, please. I didn't show you our hotel room, but this is it. <laughs> Like, there's no more to it than this, so you've already seen it, but... Yeah, we have dropped. Katie, it's okay, you'll be okay. Katie's breaking out in hives beside me. This is what I look like. So, this is such a nice dress. It's from Bershka. Not that anyone... That's my feet. It's conservative and it's slitty. I don't mean slutty, I mean slitty, as in it's got slit in it. These are my mum's Texas boots that she bought when she was drunk. I do have basically the exact same thing. They're so pointy. Like, look at that point. Slide Yeah, yeah. <gasps> Prost. <laughs> You know, I think I have an audience in Germany. Do they roll their ass? I think it goes UK, US, Germany. So prop <coughs> is what I should have said earlier. We're roaming around now in a park, trying to find where the place is. No, so don't stress out, don't stress out. I think it, no, that's not right. It's saying, is it there? Oh, should we ask them? I'm just confused. Should we ask them? Should we go, should go in there and ask them? Oh, your driver was lovely. But he doesn't know where the place is either, so. And I just can't walk fast. <laughs> Katie, she's literally just, Katie. Oh, it is up there. Thank you. I knew it was over here. I had a feeling. I just, I wanted to be 15 minutes to half an hour early. Now we're so late. It's because of the bottle of Prosecco, Katie. We had to finish it. It's and... because you wanted to take those photos. Okay, or it's because of my photos. Sky bar. No. Oh. Sky bar? Yes. Up here. We want to drink? Want to eat? Yes. Oh, we've booked. We've booked. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Stretch. That's, oh, that's, my, that's my literal vagina. I might have to blur that. <gasps> oh, look at the view. <gasps> Just pee my <gasps> No. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, Katie, you take a video. Are you taking a video? <gasps> No, look down. I'm literally getting vertigo, look. Why is there rolling shutter? Are you joking? Oh my god, I hate cameras. What's happening? I don't know what all this is. Look at these wine glasses. Are you joking? They're so nice, Katie. What is this? This is the outside of the opera house. How sick is it? I just took photos there. Praying I got a good one. I was in front of everyone. The whole of Vienna was behind me. Let's go, let's go. And there's a guy playing the accordion there. I need to vlog quickly before the people sitting in front of us come back. This is where we're sat. We have a box. It's really, really, really nice. We've just stressed for like ages to get photos. And now we want one of both of us. And the only people to take it are these two elderly parents and one child. Honestly, the thing is though, it's not even embarrassing because everyone's taking pictures. But I'm dying. No, it's not embarrassing. It's, it's more stressful. It's so stressful. You want good photographic memories of this night. You know what? I think it's our phones. They've just got a I think, I think I need a new phone. I need an iPhone 15. That's no. not that bad. This is a very beige photo, but we <laughs> can... <laughs> We can edit it to make it look like it's not that beige. Then, yeah. and then they, like, there's just... <laughs> that seat there was 200 pounds and we paid 30 pounds. Are you sure? Yeah, 100%. You're 100% sure? I did the bucket. We need to get like a drink or something, don't we? No, we start in 8 minutes. I'm can run. <laughs> Don't get undressed as I am filming. My legs are so... Really okay. wow. <laughs> the ballet was really good. Really? Nobody wore a tutu. I was really expecting some tutus. No, because it, it was like a contemporary one. I go to grab a drink. I come back with two Proseccos and like a plate of macaroons. And there's like women like surrounding Katie. I'm, I'm in an argument. Because <laughs> she was just being so horrible to me. And I was just by myself. It was just really stressful. Long story short, we were in the wrong seats. Everyone's like, show us your ticket, show us your ticket. Katie's emails won't load. So we were literally running around the opera house we said to that lady can you help us it's too late it's too late it's starting and 
there's a woman in our real seat. <laughs> At this point, the show started. It's pitch black. Yeah, and, and we have to keep this woman off yeah. our seats. I felt so bad because it was just us like 10 minutes ago. It was just one woman was just really rude. You could tell that she didn't like us because we were young and she just thought, what are they even doing here? There was like that vibe. Also, the people who were sitting behind us left after like half an hour because they couldn't see shit. We're at the Christmas market now. Look at that building. That's called the Berg Theatre. Oh, <gasps> look at the shoes. Oh my, it's like little like snow boots. Do you want a balloon, Katie? Oh. Mm. The middle bit is nicer than the end bit, I think. This is going to be so messy. I think this is meringue and a pastry. Oh, mm. oh right. It's like marshmallow. Mm -hmm. mm. And just wish it was a bit smaller, just so I could like eat it. Exactly. That was a 7 out of 10. I think the one before was really good though as well. I like the fact that I'm eating something like exotic. Like you can't get that in English Christmas market. Now. I give this a six and a half for the first one second. Okay, I agree with that. Now we are trying arancini. This is what the arancini comes in. How cute. I got spinach, mozzarella, onion. She got like a carbonara one. That is so good. Wow. Wow. It is very windy today, as you can see by my forehead. We've gone to another Christmas market. Katie was just saying everyone's here in a couple, and here we are. In a couple also. Everyone saw that. <laughs> Thank you. We found the Irish pub and Arsenal playing. I love this amount of lighting. Like I love low lighting. And we're sitting on a table with two random strangers who've gone to have a fag. We're re-entering the same market as the first, which is the market of the first one I can't speak. Oh, look at it. And it's rammo. Like it's absolutely rammed in there. Oh, we're never gonna get our sausage. We just wanna get a sausage. Oh my God, it's beautiful. It's perfect. No, the cars, Katie. Tell the cars to move out of the way. There's some kind of red light that's floating above us. Is it a heart? It's a heart, Katie. It's going into the heart tree. Look, Katie. Oh, oh my God. Thank you for passing me my sausage. Oh. That was really good. What do you rate this sausage? An eight. I just want some onions. Yeah. We didn't, but we kind of got lost on the way back, which we're going back to our hotel now. And we just went to a park. We passed these two boys, and one of them literally looked like he was 15. And they were like, are you lost, girls? And I heard, are you okay, or something? And I just went, yep, yep. And then they kind of started following us, but it wasn't a big deal. Then they stopped, and then we just walked away. So anyway, they was just like creepily hanging out in this really dark park. <laughs> That's not brilliant. <laughs> We're in a bar that we can't afford any of the drinks. We've just had apple juice and Diet Coke. Actually, it was supposed to be Diet Coke. It's called Fat. So we're getting the bill and we're leaving. We're literally shoved in the corner of the bar. It's a, I love being at the bar, but look. And also, the waiter was really rude. It's called Bar Flies. So, Bar Flies. Wait, can you see? That was actually one of the most horrific experiences of our lives. We were honestly going to leave without paying, I can't even lie. We tried like 10 times to get the bill, couldn't get it. What just horrible, the little ends. They weren't seeing us. <laughs> These people next to us sat down and they were giving a fucking bowl of pretzels. No, literally. There was a comment made about us ordering non-alcoholic drinks. And then the guy at the end, as he gave me the bill, he was like, I hope you enjoy your stay. Damn. As in, did you? And then I was like, thanks. As in like, no, I'm not going to say I did. And then we couldn't even get out without asking like three people to move. And I have got a red ribbon in my hair, yes. That's probably why they didn't even look twice at me because I have a ribbon in my hair, like Red Riding Hood. <laughs> We've now gone to our third bar. Our second one was awful too. They only take cash. They literally don't take cards. Austria is living in the past, I'm telling you. But at least we've got chips. And the guy who works it is so lovely. He's adorable. We're at the metro waiting for a train because we're on the way to get brunch. Katie's got a little plait and her bow in. I've got my bow in as well. I've got French toast. Mm. Katie's actually looks really nice. What is that? Onion? Pickled, I don't know, like onion. <laughs> So intelligent. Are those spicy? Yeah, Bella, it's chilly. Are you gonna hold it? Oh. Hey. 
We're at the um, Upper Belvedere, I think. It sounds like an Italian word though, so I don't even know if it's right. This is a museum, so we're going to the museum now. This is where the Kiss painting is by Klimt, which is the one they made me draw in, like, what year was it? Like, year seven? Katie's just walking off. Katie! Don't bother waiting for me. Look it's at me, so I look so girly. We just finished in the museum. For the most part, it was quite underwhelming. It wasn't underwhelming, I just didn't like... Yeah. <laughs> what is happening? Oh my god, I just stop. Are they talking about you? What's going on? No. Stop stressing out. I just didn't like the type of art. I don't want to see a fish hanging off a man's bandaged up penis. I also read what it was trying to say and it just didn't even make yeah, sense. Yeah, it didn't, it didn't warrant the, the art for me. But the kiss was really nice, apart from the fact that I just don't know if she wanted that kiss, to be honest. We're at the new Christmas market and there's a kiss under the mistletoe archway. Katie's getting really upset because she doesn't have a boyfriend. I'm getting upset. Look, look at it though, it's so cute. Aww. We've got this thing. I'm not really sure what it is. It basically tastes like a different version of macaroni. And cheese and Katie's rating it. No, you said nine. <laughs> this is actually a really, really cute market. Kate, Katie's just Katie's just beard. <laughs> we made it to the restaurant. This is apparently where the original chicken schnitzel was invented. <laughs> You told me the original chicken. Yeah. Mm. So what? We're going out tonight. We're going to the Travel Shack, which is recommended to us by one guy that we met last night in a bar. He okay, yeah, he worked there. He worked there. Anyway, he was really lovely. They actually look fake. We're here on the railway, and there's just two random bits of concrete. They've obviously come off some ancient building and are now just there on display. Still, no one's checked the fucking tickets. We literally paid 14 euros for absolutely no reason. Because we're in a bar, and literally, this man is just staring at her, sipping his drink, and staring. I think we're gonna move. I would stare back, though. I feel like I'm giving him what he wants. We have moved, and look at the bra collection they have over the bar. And that's not it, they're all over there, like Calvin Klein bras, Victoria's Secret bras. We literally stayed there for two cocktails and pizza. Katie was saying earlier, we were just getting so old. Like, Amsterdam, like, we were just... I don't know if I can say no, that. No, no, <laughs> that's absolutely not going in. And then Budapest, we were drinking, like going to clubs. I say well, it was literally one club. And Vienna, it's just kind of like, we just don't really know where we're going. We're packed up. We're checking out today. We're leaving. Katie's so Katie's experiencing a very normal female reproductive system. Yes. Is that right? Menstrual cycle. Anyway, she's on a period. And Katie's got cramps. Katie's got cramps. What else would it be from? Well, that just sounds nicer. Katie's got cramps. Yeah, that's what I see. <laughs> I don't think that sounds nicer. We've turned up. By the way, Katie's not being healthy. She's not just having that. We're sharing this pizza. And this is the place. Look how nice it is. And the scissors. These are gold scissors, which, well, obviously they're not real gold. They barely work, but it's just all for the vibe. And look at all the pillows. It's not very practical. It's actually not that comfy, but it's really cute. We're at the airport. Greg, Elias is here. The door is closed. I'm Greg Norton. You shut himself after a curry and theft scorn for children. I'm going to get a photo in the back for our two embarrassed to go up to him. Is it so big that that doesn't do well at the back? Look. Coming in.